Welcome back to another episode of Pushing Ladder. Now, I'm sure you guys are aware that down here between League 5 and Ultimate Champion, it gets crazy, man. About a month ago, I invented a new ladder technique. A strategy, some may call it. That is foolproof, undeniable, 100% win rate. So all you have to do to get this to work is to not play like an idiot and defend. <laughs> Every mid ladder player has just had their minds absolutely blown, I'm sure. But this tactic, I have done it in the past many times. I've got two videos on it and I have a 100% win rate with it as far as I'm aware. But basically what this entails is you're never going to go for anything offensive until we at least get to double, if not triple elixir, right? So here, we're just going to defend. I played the defensive expo. But yeah, in case you're wondering why I said in the title that this tactic just got better, it's actually because the ice wizard just got buffed which just means I can be extra defensive, right? Some people might say that, oh, well, it also means you can be more offensive because you can, like, NATO stuff in front of the tower, the ice wizard can splash, and you can win the game. But that's not how we're going to win this game, right? No offensiveness. We're not even going to go for the log here because what we're going to do is play the log down low so it never clips the tower because, again, the goal is not to get damage on their tower. It's to just defend. How did I not activate King there when he played a Goblin Barrel and the Fire and the uh, firecracker i thought i did that's why i went for the nato log by the way i'm not actually uh stupid all right well some may say i am because i'm playing this tactic but i'm here to prove this stuff actually can work and i'm not joking around when i say that it's disgustingly effective also not getting any damage on their tower makes them think like oh this guy's trolling me whatever blah 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 no this is not trolling this is hyper smart gameplay from me please don't let my ice wizard lock onto the tower no, he's ruining my plans. But anyway, at least I displayed the uh, the extra splash there. The expo, the defensive expo is going to kill all that. And yeah, in case you're wondering, Saxon, why are you in a, uh, a different building again? Here, by the way, most people would go for a log there. No. All right, we're going to go for a log right in the middle. We're going to activate King here uh, for the first time. We're going to go for a Nado as well, plus the Tesla here. And uh, we should not take too much damage. Nice. We're still in the game. Now that we've hit double elixir, it means the offensive can start now we've lulled him into a false sense of security i will go for one more defensive expo just for the time being and from here on out it's gonna be offensive baby okay so he's setting up with something in the back offensive rocket it's gonna hit that firecracker please tell me okay nice thank god that would have been embarrassing we're gonna go for the high nado plus the log no i missed the log uh please stop okay we're fine we're fine not stressed at all Valkyrie did not get into my tower there. We're gonna go for the Expo plus the Tesla here with the Evo Knight. And uh, it's good game. It's good game. Literally nothing you can do. Um, you might as well give up now, buddy. Just give up. It's not gonna work. Right? Please tell me I'm right. Hey! We get an Expo lock. Nice, finally. Uh, getting a little bit stressed there. But now we're in the damage lead again. We can go for the Ice Wizard. Slow down that hog. It's not gonna get onto my tower. And this deck is just so defensive. It's crazy. I've said this countless times. Most of these games, people actually end up quitting them. Because they're just like, fuck, I can't get any damage. I might as well stop playing. Um, and that's how we're gonna win this game. We're gonna go for the log here on the tower. Because surely that's not a deep barrel. Yes, it is, Saxon. You're just really stupid. We're gonna go for the Expo as well. Plus the Knight, because uh, we got the Evo Tesla down. Might, might as well make the most of that whilst we still have it. We're going to go for the Nado here too. Predict any bats or anything. The Tesla Shock is going to kill the Firecracker. You can go for a log here. Plus the Skeletons, please get down on time. Oh my god, wait. Expo's on tower. Somehow that Skeleton did distract it in time. I'm telling you, you cannot lose with this tactic. I dare you to try, honestly. Uh, we're going to go for the King Tower pull here on those goblins. So by the way, we are choosing the Evo Knight here plus the Evo Tesla instead of using the uh, Evolution Skeletons. That is because the Evolution Skeletons, I would liken them to more of an offensive card than a defensive one. Oh my god, can we stop this please? Why am I taking damage? The whole point of this episode is to take zero damage. Stop. Ice Wizard here. I didn't mean to play that tornado there. Of course, I'm not actually stupid. We can go for the rocket. As long as that firecracker does not get like a billion damage on my tower, then... Oh my god, we're good. Jesus Christ, that was way too close. We're against Born to Kill. Oh my god, this guy's gonna destroy me. There's no chance with a name Born to Kill. I'm not gonna get absolutely ruined. But either way, yes, like I was saying earlier, you might be wondering, Saxon, why is your setup all different? Why are you in a different place? Well, I've actually been kidnapped, right? Against my will. I uh, don't know why these guys actually want me, by the way, because I literally have no value to offer them. But they said something about making Clash Royale YouTube videos and how that um, really 
fills them with joy to see and they want to kidnap me to basically mass produced videos for them so maybe expect a few videos today what we're gonna go over here is the nato and the log again the nato is not gonna go anywhere near his tower all right that would be stupid tagging his tower with any damage at all of any sort would be really dumb here so we're gonna not lose our tower hopefully okay we take a couple hundred damage it's fine the main thing is that we didn't hit his tower with anything and that's all that really matters actually there was something i wanted to talk about today so earlier on the way here um i get being held against my will i told the driver to actually like pull up to the side because i wanted to go to a 7-eleven so i went to a 7-eleven at the start of my journey and then close to the end of my journey we drove for a few hours here i mean i didn't drive i was tied up in the back but you get what i'm saying um basically on the way here, I went to the 7-Eleven at the start, and I asked for a bottle of water, right? Of course, getting kidnapped, it's it's dehydrating, and it's quite taxing on your body. So, you know, <laughs> water is quite an Im important thing uh, in, in these kind of situations. So I go in with the simple task of having to buy water. No, I hit the tower with the log. Fuck. That was really bad by me. Guys, that's what's going to cause us to lose this game if we do lose. But hey, guess what? We're not going to lose because, again... I'm not kidding when I say this strategy is ridiculously broken. You can play terribly like I just did there. That's the most unclean, most unsatisfying defense ever. And you'll still win either way. So basically, what with this guy, what I need to do is just bait out his uh, Mega Knight. And then I can go... I mean, the Valkyrie and the Mega Knight do a bunch of damage. We also need to make sure we don't take any damage on our towers from the Firecracker or anything. I'm thinking here, maybe what I'll do... No, he's splitting up his... Oh, that's kind of smart. I'll get onto the story in a second, by the way. I haven't forgotten... <laughs> I might have a short attention span, but it's not that short, all right? Wait, wait, wait. Let's go for a Tesla here, plus the log on this wizard, plus the skeletons to surround the wizard. Kill it! Oh my god, no way, this... Jesus Christ, that was way too close. We're gonna go for a rock here on this wizard. But yeah, at this 7-Eleven, I basically say to the guy, yo, can I just get this bottle of water, please? And uh, before I paid, I then asked him, I said, oh yeah, no... Um, no receipt, please. I I don't want to. I don't want the receipt. This guy is really, really putting some pressure on. Stop. Okay. Um. Evil knight. Not evil knight. Normal knight. Stop the spear goblins, please. The king tower should help us out against that Valkyrie. Shouldn't have to play anything else on there. And then, now that we have the evil Tesla, we can go for the expo and the evil Tesla. Okay. Oh no, man. That's not a. It's not good. All right. I'll admit it. We're gonna go for the uh, the ice wizard here. That should kill the bats. Terrible placement by me. Didn't mean for the, my ice wizard to instantly die, by the way. That's not that's not part of this trick here that I've got going on. We're gonna go for another Tesla here, plus a log, plus a tornado. Nice. That's a fat NATO. Okay. Wait, I'm focused. I'm focused. I'm on the Sigma male grind set. I don't have time to be yapping about 7-Eleven stories. We're gonna go for an expo here. I know he's got the Mega Knight, so what we're gonna do is go for the Evo Knight first. Defend that against the Mega Knight. We can go for a Tesla up high on that Mega Knight as well. How many times can I say Mega Knight in three seconds? We're gonna go for the log plus the tornado. Nice clip everything. Mega Knight's gonna die. Explodes on tower. No way. No way. Wait, why did I? Valkyrie, stop! Oh my god. Wait, 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 wait. This is actually. I have actually clutched the frick up right now. Tesla. Nice. Log is gonna kill everything. We can go for another Expo here. Yeah, I won. There's nothing he can do. There's no way he defends this. Okay, Evo Knight coming down. I keep saying Evo Knight, dude. It's not an evolution. Uh, we're gonna go for this, and yeah, that's a good game. That's a good game. Expo's on tower. <laughs> There's nothing he can do, dude. Bro got so outplayed. That is ridiculous. Anyway. I'm sorry, I just have to acknowledge that that was a crazy game. I, I hand him a bill that's like way too much change, but I basically say to him, uh, I don't want the receipt, right? I say this to him in his native tongue, in my native tongue. So there's there's no way I pronounced anything wrong there. By the way, I played that log so that it touched the tower. That was a complete mistake, all right? Don't follow in my footsteps, guys. He's then like, what? You Wait, you want me to... Uh... You want me to give you only coins for this? I'm like, what, what, what the fuck? When did I say that I only wanted coins, right? And, um, but either way, I'm like, no, 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 I just, I don't want the receipt, right? And at that point, I'm, I'm also thinking like, shit, do I even tell him that I don't want the receipt? Because I just, I don't care about the confusion. It's not that important, right? It was just like a pass off comment. You know, if you could not hand me the receipt, that'd be great. Somehow we got what, like, oh my God, his tower is so low. And so it goes on for like, a couple minutes where I'm just like, no, I don't want, like, uh, I, I want coins, I want my change, I just don't want the receipt. And this person's like, oh, you want the, wait, so you don't want this, you don't, and then, basically, and, and this person did speak the language, by the way, I'm not being, like, mean, I'm, I'm just saying, this is a really weird, I'm not blaming this person either, maybe I was doing something wrong, but, eventually, the guy next to him, 
turns to him and says, the exact same way that I've been saying it, oh yeah, he doesn't want the receipt. And then the guy's like, oh, okay, sorry, my bad. I'm like, bro, what? Have I been speaking gibberish this whole time? Like, there's no way that this guy just said the exact same thing as me, and he understands it 100%. Well, either way, that was just a weird situation. Like, like I said, I, it didn't make me mad or anything. I was just like, what is going on? Like, I, it felt like I was in, like, a parallel universe where my words just meant nothing. Expo should get- okay, watch this. Nice, Expo's on tower, great. Just a little secret tactic for, the, for you guys there. We did reach double elixir, which is why I was allowed to do that. I gave myself permission uh, at that point to be able to go in with the Expo. Now we're gonna go in for Expo Tesla to bridge, and there's gonna be nothing you can do, and then we will win the game, and everything's great, I love life. And yeah, what else is there to say, man? Oh my god, Evo Tesla's broken. Oh, Sand 2 has been destroyed. But yeah, like I said, there is, um, let's just make sure we don't lose the game here. There is a little bit extra that happened, so as we were approaching this destination, my uh, kidnapper's house, I went to the 7-Eleven again to grab a coffee. And so at this 7-Eleven, I basically say, hey, could I get a coffee, please? Can I get an Americano sized M iced, right? Judge me all you want for drinking iced coffee. Shit's amazing. Um, literally, the shit that comes out after I drink that is amazing. Is he not gonna play anything? He's doing... He's doing the same challenge as me, apparently. But no, I asked for a coffee, and the guy's like, oh yeah, what size do you want? And I, was, I said, the medium size, right? And I pointed to the menu, and I said, oh yeah, that one, with at that price there, that's the one I want. And there, there was a small, a medium, and then a large, right? And he's like, oh, so you you want this cup then? And he points to the size of a cup. I'm like, dude, whatever the... Whatever the media- wait, we're gonna go for the NATO here, catch that firecracker in it. I know I logged the tower, and I know I NATO'd the tower. I am- I apologize. As, as- as tempted as I am to go for an expo to bridge here, I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, the guy's like, what size do you want, All right? And- and then he points to the cups. I'm like, dude, whatever the M is, just- just give me that. And he's like, okay, and he grabs, like, the smallest cup. And I'm like, that's clearly not an M, because it was the smallest cup. But either way, I'll leave it, right? And then when I go to pay, he charges me for the medium cup. And I was like, oh yeah, is that the medium cup? He's like, yeah. And then- a girl comes up to me and she and she's like, oh, sorry, he's like the new guy. Let me uh, let me take care of this coffee for you. Uh, what did you want again? I'm um, like an, a medium americano. And then she turns to the guy and says, what size did he order? And the guy said, it's a small. And I'm like, what the fuck? Am I like speaking a different language here? I ordered a medium. He said it was a medium. This girl comes up to me. I ask her. Uh, she asked me what size. I say a medium. And then she goes and turns around and asks, what size did the guy want? Like. I am so confused, man. I, I don't know. My brain just feels like it's shut off today. Shit's been strange. Also, it is getting insanely dark in my kidnapper's house. I'm not a big fan of this. Hopefully you guys don't mind it too much. But yeah, not too much I could do about this. I was kind of captured against my own will. By the way there, that log did not hit this tower. That was on purpose to uh, atone for my sins previously, where I did accidentally play the log onto the tower. Now we've kind of caught up that bad karma. We should be all good. I only have to play skeleton- Oh my god, wait, 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 stop, 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 firecracker, I swear to god, if you fucking shoot one more time! Ugh, my anus is tight. Anyway, we're gonna go for an expo here with this, uh, big-ass push that we've built. He went so aggressive there with his, um, whole spiel of his. Anyway, expo's on tower. God, these people, man. You need to get a grip of yourselves, alright? <laughs> Why is this tactic working? Why has it worked every single time I've played it as well? Like, it's just... It makes no sense to me, but like I said, as long as it works, it works, man. You, you Don't stress about it, right? Don't ask too many questions. That's what I've learned in life anyway. We're gonna go for the tornado here. Um, hopefully that kills that knight quicker, catches anything else he plays, and then the log's gonna kill the firecracker. Expo's on tower again. We're, I mean, we're still not in the damage lead, so the game's not over. I'm pretty sure I saw where he played that. Okay, nice. We catch that. Um, no, stop, please, Tesla. Jesus Christ, it got down in time. What we're gonna do here is play the Expo high because we wanna make sure he can't poison our tower and the Expo at the same time. Nice, he has to make a decision between the two. What we can now do is go for the tornado here, plus the log. Oh my God, good game. Get out my lobby, bro. Get out my lobby. I say that, <laughs> we're not, we haven't even won the game yet. We're gonna go for a high Tesla too. I'm expecting him to go for a firecracker to the bridge when he goes for the Evo Knight. This is gonna be, uh, sorry, Evo Drill. Jesus Christ, I can't speak apparently. Okay. Okay, man. Okay, stop. Alright, stop. You can stop now, if you'd like. You can actually, like, stop this right now. Fuck. How are we gonna win this? Okay, he just went for his poison. This is my chance, I think. We're gonna go for the Expo here. Plus the Evo Tesla. Plus the Ice Spirit up high. And basically, as long as he doesn't get anything else on the tower, we should win. Stop. Stop. Well, you know what? That game doesn't count if I get an Epic here. 
Okay, well, I guess the game does count. Uh, well, we're ending it there, folks. Anyway, it's getting dark in my kidnapper's house, so I am gonna go to bed now. Click there if you wanna see another video. Like, comment for the algorithm, subscribe. Yeah, either way, try it out. Relatively flawless, I'd say. You know what? A 90% win rate. It's not bad. Free to play tomorrow? 